Pushpa Gujral Science City, a joint endeavor of Government of India and Government of Punjab, is a premier science communication facility set up on Jalandhar Kapurthala Road. With four theatres, 13 galleries, simulators and parks, a mobile science exhibition and an innovation hub, it aims at inculcating scientific temper and generate and nurture creativity. The Women Technology Park at Pushpa Gujral Science City is an important program of the Science City where we are trying to associate ourselves with the local population, especially the women in the area. The objective of the park is to take science to the literate, semi-literate and illiterate women in the society, which we primarily do through three types of trainings which we provide to them. For example, we provide them training on uh, computerized embroidery and block printing. Uh, we also provide them training on pleurotus cultivation or dhingri cultivation, which is an important flavoring agent and it is very highly priced. And we also provide training to the illiterate women to convert cow dung and paddy straw, mix it together and convert it into uh, pots as well as cow dung logs. These logs and pots can be sold in the market. We would like to thank DST for this initiative and, uh, for, and for sponsoring us for the same. The Women Technology Park at Pushpa Gujral Science City is an attempt to ensure that benefits of science and technology percolate to rural women of the surrounding villages and provide them science-based livelihood opportunities. The park was formally inaugurated on November 8, 2020 by the Joint Commissioner, Department of Rural Development and Panchayats in the presence of Deputy Commissioner and Additional Deputy Commissioner Kapoorthala. The park comprises of three training units mushroom cultivation with special focus on dhingri, block printing and computerized embroidery, preparation of cow dung logs and pots. The mushroom cultivation unit. Dhingri is a special variety of high value fungi which is used in food especially as a flavoring agent. The use of pleuritus as a human food dates back to antiquity. Dhingri cultivation is simple and economical in rural areas where raw materials, normally straw and facilities required are easily available. Dhingri is a high value product. Dried dhingri is sold at the rate of rupees 2000 to rupees 3000 per kg and wet dhingri is sold at the rate of rupees 300 per kg. ਤੇ हमने पिछले साल साइंस सिटी पार्क से ढिंगरी मशरूम की ट्रेनिंग ली तो पिछले साल हमने अपने घर में एक बहुत कम उगाए थे अब की बार बहुत ज्यादा उगाए हुए हैं और इसमें बहुत सारा प्रोटीन होता है अगर हमारी सेल भी ना हुई तो हम अपने घर में अपने बच्चों को खिला सकते हैं इसमें प्रोटीन भरपूर मात्रा में है कैंसर की बीमारी को भी कंट्रोल करता है और इसमें बहुत फायदा है इसमें लागत बहुत कम लगती है हम बाजार से लेके बच्चों को नहीं खिला सकते हम अपने घर में मेहनत करके अपने बच्चों को प्रोटीन भरपूर मात्रा में सब्जी दे सकते हैं Block Printing and Computerized Embroidery Unit. This unit imparts practical training on value addition to textiles by using traditional hand block printing coupled with computer aided embroidery. The training unit is equipped with machines, engraved wooden blocks, dies, 
printing tables, computerized embroidery machine and other requisite accessories. During COVID-19 pandemic, the park has trained about 120 women in stitching of three-layered cotton masks. Sat Shri Akal Ji, my name is Pooja. The Women Technology Park has been known for a long time. When the Science City was the Women Technology Park team, they had been trained for a long time. 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 I had chosen to choose and they had been पंद्रह दिन अंदर ट्रेनिंग दिन दे पैसे थे मैं उन्हें तो बहुत कुछ सीखा तो मैं कई तरह के प्रोडक्ट्स बना के सेल की थी जिन्हें तो काफी आमदन हो इसी में नो ते मैं जानती हूँ कि साइंस सिटी दे जेडे वुमेन टेक्नोलॉजी पार्क दे टीम आ इन्हें दा तानवाद करना चाहती हूँ मैं इन्हें दे करके मैं सानू वेमेन टैक्नोलॉजी पार्क बारे उदो पता लग गया जो साढ़े पिंड इतों एक टीम ही आई उन्होंने सूँ आन के बहुत वैली गाइड किया तो फिर सानू इस उन्होंने ब्लॉक प्रिंटिंग सारे प्रोजैक्ट बारे समझाया तो फिर मैं सोचा कि मैं ब्लॉक प्रिंटिंग भी कर सकनी हाँ तो फिर असी ब्लॉक प्रिंटिंग जी सीखनी स्टार्ट की ये आई टी सी मानव विकास संस्था ने यह सारा सूँ सहूलत दिखाई कि असी आ जाइए आ आ दी जा सारी सहूलत उन्होंने प्रोवाइड की ये सारा कुछ सानू उन्हों द्वारा ही प्राप्त होया तो हूँ एज दिस टाइम असी ये सारा कुछ भी सीख चुके हैं तो हूँ असी अपना भी ये काम करते हैं इस टाइम मेरी बुटीक है तो मैं अपना काम भी करती हाँ जो भी असी उतो सीख्या है वो साढ़े हूँ काम आ रहा है तो ये मैं आत्म निर्भर भी बन चुकी हूँ The Cowden Logs and Pots Unit. This training upgrades the women from handmade cow dung cakes to cow dung logs by the use of technology, thus relieving them from a menial job and reducing their drudgery. Cow dung log is a combination of dung and straw or any agro waste or harvested crop residue. It is fed into a hopper of the machine. The machine mixes raw materials thoroughly compress them and extrude them out by using different size of die logs of different shapes and sizes can be made easily the logs can be used in boilers and cremation grounds the training is also provided at goshala sites training on cow dung pots is also given in this unit the pots are eco friendly and a great substitute to plastic bags used for saplings Apart from practical and hands-on training, the WTP at PGSC also helps the women trainees in establishing market linkages and provides an incubation facility. We work in close coordination with Department of Rural Development and Panchayats Punjab, the District Administration, NABARD, KVK and reputed NGOs of the city like the Manav Vikas Sansthan to provide maximum support to these women groups the women technology park at science city is a step beyond general science outreach to science based skill development which enables rural women to earn their own livelihood the success stories of women trained by wtp pgsc has been widely covered by the media so far the park has trained more than 400 women from providing various skills and trainings to connecting these rural women to potential employers science city is making an attempt to bridge the gap between the rural community and employment